The Moab House hosted a car show in street fair earlier today. Event organizers say this is a God-given vision from 2019, and it's now a reality. First News reporter Ashley Bell shares more. The cars behind me are doing more than just sitting pretty. They've come out today to support Moab House, a community organization that helps young adults who have aged out of the foster care system. We started with a small Facebook group and we started auctions right online and our group grew and I just shared the vision with them. Marcy Consiglio says the small Facebook group now holds over 1,000 members who are helping with their vision. She says they did not know how this was going to work, but she and the group kept working. We just got our first house and it is over at the Mahoning Valley Campus of Care and that's an all nonprofit campus. The house will be a home to eight young adults who are transitioning out of foster care. The house will have a set of house parents that will live on site. 100% of the proceeds from the car show and fair will go to Moab House. When we have them in the house, what they will be learning is they will be learning all of the skills that they need to establish in order to be able to transition out properly. Joshua Drone emancipated out of foster care. He had the opportunity to be a part of the Bridges program through Moab House. He says without the program, he wouldn't have been able to graduate from Youngstown State University with a degree in education. These guys are doing something pretty interesting. These guys are giving uh, kids a chance that not many used to have. Drone says that he thinks foster care sometimes gets neglected. He is grateful that Moab House brings awareness to the Valley. The goal of the organization is to equip the young adults with the skills to be contributing members of society. Everything is all for the mission of being able to afford the house. The cars at the fair paid a registration fee and were judged on Best in Show, Best Classic, and Best Import. There were four judges, including WKBN's own Jennifer Rodriguez. In Struthers, Ashley Bell, WKBN 27 First News. Hi everyone, I'm Lindsay Watson. Thanks for watching the WKBN 27 First News YouTube channel. If you want more video news, subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the WKBN 27 First News app for breaking news alerts.